The Northern Group, under the auspices of Arewa Advocates for Good Governance, has described federal government's approval for the design of the 1,000-kilometer Sokoto Badagri Coastal Highway by the current administration of President Tinubu as monumental. The group underscores the road project as advancing infrastructure development across the nation and bridging gaps, fostering unity and economy. Addressing a conference in Kaduna, the national chairman of the group, Jamilu Mato, says the project is a milestone to the nation's infrastructure. Infrastructure development, transforming, transforming and connecting trading activities across different regions across the nation. He added that construction of coastal routes have potential to attract foreign investment and contribute significantly to the GDP of the country. The construction of these coastal roads in the country has the potential to attract foreign investment and contribute to a stronger Naira. Today, we can proudly thank President Tinubu on his renewable agenda, particularly its profound impact on transforming Nigeria's road infrastructure landscape. The approval of the construction of Sokoto to Badagri Road underscores President Tinubu's commitment to advancing infrastructure development across the nation, bridging gaps, fostering unity, and economic growth. We are also aware that the Tinubu's led government is planning to connect the six geopolitical zones in the country with a network of roads that will foster a more secure, safer, and sustainable transportation system. The group passed a vote of confidence on the President and Honorable Minister of Works, Engineer David Mweze Umai, for their steadfast dedication and tireless efforts in championing the transformative project. As representatives of the Northern populace, we stand united in passing a vote of confidence on President Tinubu's visionary leadership and Engineer David Umai's exemplary stewardship at the Federal Ministry of Works, assuring Mr. President and the Minister of Works of our uncompromising support and solidarity in their efforts to advance Nigeria's infrastructure agenda and fulfill the aspirations of our people. They appealed to the former president, Atiku Abubakar, not to mislead Nigerians over comments on the road construction project, urging him to join in rebuilding the country for national development, while calling on all Nigerians to support the government for a better Nigeria, where connectivity, unity, progress and prosperity are accessible to all. To caution the former Vice President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Alaji Atuka Abubakar, to show some level of understanding about the good policies of the Tinubu led administration, especially on his stance on the awarded Lagos to Calabar Coastal Highway and not to mislead Nigerians with his utterances. Behind himself, the defeat he suffered in the last elections and doing hands with President Aswajibola and Tinubu in his quest to move Nigeria forward. Call on all Nigerians to join hands with the Bola and Tinubu's led government. In this turn of transformation, a renewed hope agenda. Together, we will continue to strive for Nigeria where connectivity, unity, progress, and prosperity are accessible.